painful can it be to be called stingy when you are actually trying to be frugal and get your life together so you can save something for tomorrow? Who cares? We're at that point where it really doesn't matter what people think. What matters is the journey and you have to stick with it until the end. Today, I shall be talking about the difference between uh, stingy and frugal. It's important that we really clarify uh, the difference between the two. Let's dive into the topic already. Watch till the end, share and comment, and let's learn and grow together. Okay, so let's even look at the definition of stingy. Now, being stingy is when one excessively and unreasonably holds on to their money in a way that becomes detrimental to their relationship and their well-being. They hold tight to things and don't um, lose grip of it. Now, that is being stingy. You excessively and unreasonably holding on to your money to the detriment of your relationship with your family, friends, and everyone, and your own well-being. You have this money, but you're not spending on yourself, neither are you spending on your family and the people around you, especially where it's important. Now, spending, I do not mean reckless spending. If, if you're not spending recklessly and someone calls you stingy, now that is the person's headache. But you need to understand that as a person, there are basic needs that we must spend on if we want to at least live a comfortable life. So, being stingy is excessively and unreasonably holding on to your money to the detriment of your relationship and your well-being. Now, people who are stingy prioritize their money over anything else health relationship connections they really don't care they prioritize their money over anything you can think of those are people who are stingy they won't spend irrespective or regardless of what the situation is you can't take their money away from them that's a person who is stingy you know you can't just take the money from them but then let's look at frugality what does it mean to be frugal what's frugality being frugal or frugality means spending your money carefully or careful and mindful spending of your money in a way that it does not reduce the quality of your life, neither does it affect it. Frugality is spending your money carefully or in a mindful way, in such a way that it still does not reduce the quality of your life, neither does it affect it. Now, that is being frugal. A person who is frugal is disciplined about how they use and spend their money or where their money goes. Now, being frugal allows you to at least have something on the side, have something left every time money comes to you. You do not eat it all. You have something left so you can have more tomorrow. So that is the idea of being frugal. Nobody, nobody wants to intentional, intentionally inflict harm on his or herself or the people around them when they know they can do better, when they have enough. We all want to party with family and friends if we can afford it. I mean, what is life if you're not enjoying and living it? We are not supposed to just exist, but we need to make enough money to get to a point where we will live the life 
you want. And if you do not already have all of that money, you need to kickstart yourself. Do what you have to do that is legal for you to give that life to yourself. And one of those things is being frugal. Being frugal, for example, could mean that you live on a budget, yes. You make budget for the things you want to do, whether long or short term. You eat at home instead of eating out. You always find out, find ways to cut down on expenses and save more. That is being frugal. You say do the things that needs to be done, but then you have something left for the future. That is being frugal and avoid unnecessary waste. Avoid things if they are not uh, such that you need or will harm you if you don't do them. Frugal people always find ways to make informed spending decisions. That's why they live and work with budget. And even at that, they still find ways to enjoy their lives. You know, using what they have to meet their need in a way that's still um, enjoyable. You may want to ask, you may want to ask, what sets frugal person and a stingy person apart? Of course, there are. Now, for a frugal person, he retains his connection with the people in his life, but spends wisely according to budget while maintaining their well-being relationship and connection with the people and the things around them. But a stingy person destroys everything with just the aim of accumulating more and more and they don't care and these people often end up unhappy they save this they, they, they keep money at the expense of their own happiness their life but they have money but they look very unhappy unkept and like they're going to die tomorrow but when you're frugal, you can still be happy, love all you want, get the things you want or alternative to things that you may have want so you can save and then everybody in your life is still happy and well connected to you. Do you get the gist? You see that the two are very and totally different. So it's important that we maintain a, a balanced um, approach towards saving and the balanced approach is frugality instead of being stingy and destroying oneself. It's also important to consider the fact that you could still achieve the aim of saving and being financially free without necessarily becoming um, stingy. How do you do that? Take the balanced approach of frugality. For example, uh, while being frugal, you can create your budget and then um, live on it. Then concentrate and focus on living your life with the small you have or with as small as possible within your disposal. Live a good life and do not just exist because you want to save and prioritize experiencing and living life over just uh, material possession or accusation. A frugal person is not about accumulating and accumulating, no. It's more of living on a budget and saving something. But a stingy person only accumulates and prioritize a uh, possession over living and experience. Both stingy and frugality have one thing in common. The aim is to save, okay? They both have the aim of saving more. So, frugality is a balanced approach towards that, um, towards saving, 
while stingy is a destructive and an unhappy approach towards a financial freedom or saving. Now that you know the differences between uh, being stingy and frugal, I am sure you won't be worried again if someone uh, misunderstands you and accuses you of being stingy while you are trying to be frugal. And I tell you, a frugal lifestyle will pay you in no time. Thank you for watching till the end and I want to encourage you to subscribe for subscribe to this channel for more financial tips and advice and you will be grateful for it. I love you always and I am always rooting for you.